Hello Dissenters! My name is Italics and I am here today in the world of Starforge. Once again, yes, this is my second time, second video playing this game and this time we're gonna be traveling to space. Yes, that vast area directly above this planet where you can faintly actually make out some planetary bodies back there. It looks like another planet and some asteroids in the distance. I don't think you can actually walk around on those. But what do I know? I really don't know. So I've learned this method of how to get quickly to out of outside of the atmosphere, and so I'm going to show you how to do that here briefly. And then I don't really know what we're going to do from there. I don't think there's really any gameplay up there, per se. I'm sure we could set up some kind of space fort. But other than that, I really I don't know. So let's just get started, shall we? I'm going to hit the number two on the keyboard to bring up my building menu where I can place blocks and things like that, and since I want to be extra fancy today, let's change the type of block that we're using. I want to use... where is that really fancy looking one? Is it this one? Yes! Okay, so we're gonna use this block. Got it on the first try, we're gonna delete these. Alright, let me see if I can get this correctly. We're gonna switch into third person here. Alright, we've got the blocks, and so what we want to do is find a spot we can build on, and then right click, and then hold down the right mouse button. So I've still got the right mouse button held down, so we're moving in slow motion. Now what I want to do is not get too close, but look towards the bottom of this block. Alright, then we're going to hold left click, and then we're going to start tapping spacebar rapidly to attempt to jump, and then we're going to fly really, really high, jumping like the Hulk right here. Now this is in fact a strategy I learned from another YouTuber, so to give proper credit where credit is due, I've got the link to his video in the description of this video, so you can check out the original for yourself if you so choose, and I think I'm going to fail this. So what I need to do, oh no, 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 I'm going to fail, I'm going to fail, build underneath me. Oh no, I'm gonna fall. <laughs> Alright, we got this. We got this, guys. It's okay. So what you have to do, you will stop. You can't just go forever. And I think I've landed. Oh, that was like perfect. I didn't fall or anything. Okay, so I can let go of the right mouse button. We have safely landed on this platform that we just built. Basically what that super jump will allow you to do is get a ton of air quickly, but you will not be able to go forever. So you have to, every so often, look down beneath you and build a platform that you can land on. Usually you're going to end up falling on said platform, so it's a good idea to make it quite big just in the event <laughs> that something bad happens and you fall at a later point so you don't have to start all the way over. Alright, so I know this is not this is not appealing to my OCD right now, but we're just going to press on with the second jump, and I'm not going to make you guys sit here for the entire time that I'm doing this. Once again, holding down the right mouse button, looking down, holding the left mouse button now, and then tapping spacebar to get some air. So this is what we're just going to keep doing over and over again until we reach space, and yes, you can actually go to space in Star Forge. There is no real ceiling on how high you can go. Actually, you know what? I'm sure there is eventually. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna need to uh, dig, make a little platform for us to fall on again. It can be a little bit tricky, especially when you're turning. And it's uh oh, I'm gonna f I'm gonna fall right right back here. Uh oh, we've I don't know if this is gonna work. Okay, woo, we got just the right angle. Can I land it? Yes, I've landed it once again. What am I doing? Am I doing a backflip? What is going on right now? <laughs> He's doing some kind of like Heisman hurdle or something like that. Okay, can we land it? Can we land it? I'm scared. Alright, we're just gonna let go. Alright, alright, we're safe. We are safe, just barely. So it can be pretty scary because if you fall, you will fall all the way back to the ground and have to pretty much start all the way over, assuming that you don't land on one of your previous platforms. I don't even remember what I was saying before this. Oh, um, I'm sure that there is some kind of like ultimate height limit that you can get to, but space is not that limit as far as you can actually get above the atmosphere. And I think I've actually seen where some people have have gotten all the way up to these asteroids that are kind of floating around here, so I don't really know what to expect. Alright guys, so I'm going to come back to you when I've made a little bit more progress and so you can see exactly how high I've gotten. I'm scared to get to the edge right now, but you can kind of make out barely how far up I am above the, the surface of the world here. So I'll be right back here in just a sec. Oh no, I did something. I did something very bad. <laughs> what did I do? Oh no. Oh no. Where am I going? I'm going up being, being thrown into outer space. What is happening? <laughs> I'm upside down. Oh, oh, there's blocks underneath me now. 
Oh no, I can't tell which way's up. I'm just kind of holding down the slow motion button right now. I can't tell, I can't tell where, where's, where am I pointing? What's going on here, guys? Let's see if I can like switch camera angles and see exactly what's happening here. Oh jeez, I can't get the pointer to go below me, so I can build- Oh, there's the- there's the block I just built. Oh no, there it is. There it goes. There it goes. Oh no. I'm going so fast! <laughs> oh, that sound is so painful! That sound is so very painful. Alright, here we are. In space. Just to give you a better perspective of what's going on, here's the third person view so you can see exactly how high up I am. I'm going to cautiously walk towards the edge here and attempt to lean over. You notice that when I look down my frame rate drops, it seems like the game is still registering all the blocks that I've built to come up this way even though I can't actually see them. So hopefully that's something that'll get tweaked over time, but yes! I have made it to space, or what appears to be space. I'm sure that the map, or the, yeah, I'm sure that the ceiling goes higher than this because I've seen videos of people like walking towards asteroids and I believe, well maybe the, maybe it looks closer than it is but it looks like I'm fairly close to the level of the asteroids. I'm probably like, I don't know, 10 jumps or more above the cloud level. So just to kind of put that in perspective, everything is a lot further away than it seems. So what I'm going to do now is build like a rudimentary space fort, I guess. Just probably start by extending this one, one around all the way. I don't know exactly what to make. I know the odds are against me as far as I'm sure that I'm going to fall down at some point <laughs> while, while messing around up here. What's really saddening is that there's no save game feature yet. So next time I want to go back to space, I'm going to have to do this all over again. And the reason that I didn't have like any kind of fast forward visual for you guys showing me making these this ascent is because I fell like two or three times and completely failed <laughs> so I decided uh, that I would just go ahead and cut to the point you know where I'm actually here above cloud level and have something to show for myself whoa don't want to sprint that's dangerous we do not we do not want to do that I don't really know what I'm doing I don't have any kind of design planned right now I'm just kind of goofing off just designing a little bit of like a space fort. Probably not the best material to do this. This is gonna be like a regal space fort. We got this fine looking wood here. <laughs> and then, and then once I've built a small building up here, a small structure, we're going to jump and plummet down to the planet. And then I have one other thing I wanna try, so we'll see if that actually works or not. It's easier for me in first person, so I'm gonna do that. And we're gonna build, we're gonna make it pretty symmetrical, I believe and just kind of have it go like a little archway maybe up like this and then over oh well, I didn't count count that out right but that looks fine that looks fine we'll go with that so I'm gonna do the same thing on all sides and then we'll make a little walk we'll make a little diving board out I'm not trying to make anything <laughs> anything elaborate here just something to stake my claim on space oh <laughs> did you see that I started sprinting and my character like leapt at this wall. Can you imagine if I did not have a wall there? I would have careened straight off of it and that would have been very embarrassing after all this hard work. Whoops, too, one too far. All right, so now we got a, a basic structure here. It's the same on all sides and we're gonna make a little walkway kind of heading out to each side here so that I don't fall off and we'll probably make a little rail out of another material here. So let's get the, uh, the inventory, or I guess I'll call it the inventory open. And let's switch over to, I don't remember which of these, okay, so that's what block that is, I want the other one, I want this one, oops, what am I, what am I doing here? Alright, so let's not fall through that, uh oh, I've got the, like, the delete version on, <laughs> not, not what I'm looking for. There we go, there we go, that looks a little snazzier, not really, but I'm just gonna do it anyway, <laughs> because why not? Alright, now on this side, you know what, we're not gonna do that for every single side, I'm kinda, Kind of getting a antsy here. Oh, you know what we should do? We should do. We should make a, uh, a little staircase up here. Uh, where should we do that? Let's wall one of these sides off. Let's just go ahead and wall this side off. It's not going to be completely symmetrical. It's okay, guys. Don't don't worry. Don't freak out. Then we're going to make stairs leading up, and then we're going to make a roof on top of that. Okay, this is going to be the fun part. Okay, sprint. Whoa, whoa. Okay. Alright, so this first jump is successful. This might be- Oh, wait, no, I fell back down. This is dangerous, guys. 
I'm sorry, but this is dangerous. <laughs> I'm gonna fall. All right, you got this. You got this, man. Just go up the next one. Nope, 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 nope. You almost got it. Oh, there you go. One more. No, 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 no. <laughs> Dang it. All right, all right. So we gotta make a little ceiling here. So I have something to stand on. There we go. All right. Oh! I fell! We're just taking the dive, taking the dive straight back to the planet. I told you guys I was gonna fall off. I would have liked to have anticipated this a little bit more, but you can see now! You can see now how easy everything can suddenly go to waste. <laughs> there we go. Flying past our gigantic elevator structure here. My frame rate is dipping. I apologize for that. Ow! Did you hear my guy just yell like that? I landed on one of my platforms. <laughs> That seems to happen in every video. Okay, so now that we've fallen, you know what? We're still technically in space. So this is, this is why you make, like, security platforms, okay, guys? If you want to do this at home, make these giant platforms in case you fall. You can at least land. So right now, I'm only probably, like, three jumps away from being as high as I was, and I'm still in space, so it's all good. But you guys get the general idea. I think you're about ready for me to jump all the way back to the surface and see how long that takes. So what we're going to do is we're just going to sprint off the edge here. All right, here we go. Run and jump. Here we go. Oh, jeez. Hopefully I don't land on any more of my platforms. That would be really awkward. So let's get back into first-person mode. We can see, look how big that is. How many, those are all different jumps that I had to make in order to get this high. I think I can see the ground right now. Yep, there it is coming into view. <laughs> so we... We are pretty high up here. This has really got nothing on Minecraft's 256 block height limit, I don't think. I don't even know what the ceiling is. I don't know if anybody's reached the ceiling. If you know, let me know. Here we go, crush the ground. Oh, jeez. Man, he was up on his feet in no time flat. But as you can see, that is ridiculous. It just goes and goes and goes and goes. So I have one last thing that I really want to try right now. So we're gonna, we're gonna try this out. I got the digging tool. And we're going to dig all the way through, kind of like we did accidentally at the end of the last episode. And if you haven't seen that episode, you probably should have checked it out before you watch this one. But I've got the link in the description of this video if you do want to go see that. Alright, so what I'm trying to do here is dig underneath the planet. And the digging tool is being a little finicky right now. And you're probably getting disoriented, so I'll go into third person. There we go. Alright, sorry for making all you dizzy. And now we're going to change dimensions. And we're going to come back up here, go past our our elevator right here and what I want to do is make like a like a circle all the way through to the other end of the earth <laughs> so we've fallen back through the world again I just had to try this out just to see if it's possible oh no wow man I am just inflicting so much pain on myself so apparently it's that you don't come out the same spot every single time it looks like it's a little bit random so you can see right there is the hole I just dug I believe Let's see if we can like jump into it here we go. Can he make the money shot? No, he's not going to make it. Alright, so it's impossible to actually, unless you just dug out the entire area. What I wanted to do was, you know, dig all the way down and just have it where every time you fell through the world, you just go back through the other side like it's impossible to get out, kind of like, kind of like in a portal. <laughs> but no, he keeps, he's landing on top of the structure that I've made, so it's okay. Anyways guys, this has been Starforge. I encourage you to go check this game out for yourself if you have not already. Understand it does not work on many of your machines, but it will be optimized over time. Hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it. My name is Italics, and I will see you next time.